What's up, everybody? It's your boy Jeff back in with another video. And today I just want to talk about clones and fakes as far as Apple accessories and how easy it is to get had without you even knowing. So let me just show you something real quick. So here we are. Now I'm going to turn on my iPhone here and I'm going to turn these babies up. Show you this pair and this pair. I'm not going to say anything. They look similar. They sound great. They both sound awesome. This one is a wireless case. This one is a regular case. But you know what I'm saying? They look great. We open this baby up. And as you can see, bam, comes out. Beautiful. Now, they sound great. They hook up great. Now, you see this one missing here. See that? And that's the reason that I had to go to the Apple store because I lent them to my daughter. I bought them off market. And they look legit. They sound great. But I went to the Apple store for the simple fact that I needed to get one replaced. I heard you could get one for 59 bucks or 69 something like that. But I went to the Apple store. I said, listen, I need an earbud. And I lost one of my earbuds, you know, for my case, for my AirPods too. So they're like, hey, you got to see the Geek Squad because we got to hook them up to your serial number of the case and whatnot so you know only the geek squad could do that so i waited out you know and baboom they took care of me and they said sorry sir these ain't legit these are clones and i'm like what i mean i know i bought them you know say it off uh the marketplace you know something like that but the box was new it looked beautiful they hook up as you can see the w1 chip work where everything popped up so what's going on no these are legit no sorry these are not these are clones and i'm like can't find the serial number there's nothing coming out so i'm like what the hell so right away you know what I'm saying i had bought ones from the apple store for my daughter and like i said i have them both they both sound great and basically the only reason i found out these were clones was because you know i had to go to the apple store and get a replacement if not i will never know i mean connection great sound great the whole nine you'll be totally satisfied with the clones if you didn't know they weren't clones but unfortunately you cannot replace them and that's how i find out now open these up show you guys bam opens up got a little color going everything's legit here and now you're gonna ask me jeff as a consumer what am I, some a private investigator? What, I mean, I'm supposed to, like, you know, detect clones? How the hell am I going to detect a clone from the real deal? If they all seem to have the W1 chip and they all seem to sound great. Listen, the only reason I found out these were clones is because I had to go to the Apple store and get a replacement. If not, I will never know. So, the only thing that I see that I could tell the difference and these things, not even the employees at the Apple store could tell me was that. Check this out. So I'm going to open these up. Let's wait for it to come out. Boom. It came up. No, we want chip. It connected. All right. Now, I go to settings. And if you look here in settings, where it says network, where it says here Wi-Fi and all this stuff right here, See, down here, you should have AirPods come out if they're legit copy. That's the only way you can tell. And nothing comes out. Right? Now, let's open the ones that I bought in the Apple store. Let's wait for it. Bam, it came out. So you can see, I think it's cool. And let's look over here. As we click, look what it says here now. You guys can see. Zoom in a little bit, you guys can see. My girl's AirPods, Maria's AirPods. I click on it, and there goes the serial number of the whole nine. Bam, it's there, right? I close it. And bam, it disappears. Again. <laughs> open these the clones and something should come up and mind you they sound great I had no complaints about these you know what I'm saying it's not like you know they sound great they're awesome but hey boom pops up connected 
Let's wait for it to come out on the Wi-Fi settings here. And as we wait here, we wait. My man, nothing pops up. Empty. They're not Apple registered products. And I think that's the only way you could tell. Only way you could tell. No other way, guys. Unfortunately, that's the only way you could tell. So, you know, if anybody sells you, and listen, the clones are unbelievable. They sound unbelievable. They look unbelievable. They work unbelievable. Like I said, only way I find out, bam, I had to go to the Apple store. So, don't get caught out there like the way I did. I mean, I'm happy with them. Unfortunately, I cannot get a replacement from them. That's my only problem because they sound awesome. They wire wirelessly charge. I mean... Seriously, the clones are getting so good that, you know, even if you try to inspect the box and everything, it's like, you know, said it's almost impossible. And now with the W chip being, you know, that pop-up thing coming out, I think it's the W1 chip or H1 chip or whatever they call it. It's really no way to tell. The only way you could tell is going to about and seeing the settings and seeing that it's an Apple registered product that's going to come out under the Wi-Fi screen. Uh, first go about. I mean, go to general, set about, and look for the Wi-Fi box like I showed you before. And that's the only way you could tell. So anybody try to sell you some, do what you got to do. Come right here. And they have to pop up right here under the Wi-Fi box right there. So anyway, hopefully that helped. <laughs> this is your boy, Jeff. See ya.